do you want an intro like this? Watch a full video. And if you want a 3D spinning intro and everything like that, watch the video too, because it's going to give you a guide to both of these. So the first thing you're going to want to do is download the intro maker app, which I'm going to show you how to download right now. Um, you got to go to the app store right now, and then you got to go search, and then you got to type in 3D intro maker. Right now I already typed it in, that's how I download the app, but I'm just going to type it in again. 3D intro, no not intro, intro maker. And then when you download that, you can download the first one because that one costs money. So that's the one that I kind of don't recommend if you're on a budget and stuff like that. I'm on a budget, so I'm not going to buy it. But if you get, you should download, or if you want it for free, tell them the second one. And that one is the one we'll be using today in this video or tutorial. Then that I already was using it for my own self for Noodle 2. That's in, yeah, Noodle 2. Um, the ones with the stall on the top right corner are premium, which you have to buy. And if you're going to buy that, might as well buy the first app. You know what I mean? Yeah. Well, the first thing you gotta do is click on the template you want. I wanted the ninth shark, whatever you call it. And then yeah. Then from there you gotta customize it. That white little bar, type tap on it and it'll then it'll let you like you know what I mean? It'll let you change the name. I'm gonna change mine to noodle. I might have like a little trouble right now spelling it, but who cares? Alright, I'm really having bad trouble typing this. You can totally tell. Noodle, and then you gotta go to text two. And then you could use text three if you want if you want your intro to have one more little sentence. But I don't recommend it. And you and at the bottom right corner you could change your font, but I, like I said again, there's a little premium store there. You can change the color of it and you can do all those settings at the bottom of the screen. As you guys see I'm right now I'm changing the font. I'm really having a hard time, as you really can tell. Since you use permanent marker. Okay, so this is how your intro can be. And if you want it like this, tap the right, the right hand, um, the right hand, little, um, what do you call it? That one thing. I don't know. Tap the right hand corner. With the check mark, check mark, there it is the check mark. If you want your intro to be like that, but I want mine to be different, and I want mine not to be a 3D intro, I want mine to have a montage in it. And you can do some of the settings I'm using right now. There is a lot of ads, and you could add music if you want to add your own music from your iTunes or anything like that. You could, that's just why it's just mine having a little problem, which I'll get into in the next video. Yeah, you see. Taking it very hard, and right now I'm a little, I'm a little sad, pretty sad. But um, yeah, you can do that and change the, the music. And then if you're not happy with the the 3D intro, the way it's coming out right now, if you're not happy with the way it's coming out right now, you see the T at the left hand corner, the middle of the screen, that that, that thing. Yeah, right there where I'm tapping. If you don't want it to be like that, like the spinning and stuff like that. You could just change it to one of your camera roll shots, and then you can turn it into the way I have it right now. And I'm just looking for something to put on. I'm not gonna choose a selfie, but yeah. All right, and I'm choosing that clip, my montage clip I added in my video. So just go choose it, and it'll be like that, and it'll say noodle. You know, it's a noodle, and then it's noodle gaming. Get then you see, then get the right, the right check mark. Yeah, I like it, so I, I press the right check mark and go gallery, video shop. That's my old editing app, iMovie, any of those. It can send it to. But I just chose gallery for I can post it into this video. And then that's the whole tutorial. If you guys enjoyed, please smash that like button. Uh, that one of you one is still coming today, and yeah, a lot of edits and stuff like that. Thank you.